Hey guys, I hope you guys are doing lovely. I just wanted to come in and tell you guys hi. I felt like putting on a little makeup and putting on one of my units today. Oh, the struggle is real. Um, so how you guys doing? Just tell me how y'all doing. Today is a good day. That's what I gotta tell myself. Today is gonna be a good day. My daughter made the best pink lemonade. Mmm. Bless. I really ain't had nothing to talk about, but I guess we could talk about. Don't worry about if you don't have what you really need to have. Be happy within the moment, the current moment that you are in. Be grateful for the current moment. This is the season of people wanting to, you know, shop Shouty. for Thanksgiving. Y'all, I'm not even going to cook big on Thanksgiving. I'm cooking, oh, you know, a small meal. Um, stuff like potato salad, make some barbecue slaw ribs, do some hot wings. May fry a little chicken wings. Going to do dressing, baked macaroni and cheese. And my daughter going to make some sweet um, potato pies. And I'm also going to make some yams with marshmallows in them. And I'll probably get like one or two cakes and some ice cream. But I want to tell you, don't worry about if you can't afford to have this traditional meal that everybody is going to be cooking. You know, I always try to think about people that don't have, you know, like the homeless. You know, are they going to be warm? Are they going to have enough food to eat? Um, or do they have family members that are going to come out and bring them something to eat? Some, you know, some blankets to keep warm or something to drink, jugs or water. Think about that when you get in your feelings and you think like, oh, I wish I had this, but I ain't got enough to buy this and do this. Think about people that don't have it. A lot of times when we worry and and we doing all this whining to God, praying for these things that we really don't need at the current moment. I always think about what you have that somebody else don't have. I got a roof over my head. I got lights on. I got running water. My house is clean. I got food in the fridge. You know, I'm comfortable. I got Wi-Fi. You know, who, who else wouldn't be grateful for the things that I just named? All right? So don't get all up in a bunch. Don't feel depressed. You know, make a meal, make whatever you can, make to a family member house, a friend house, excuse me, and get a plate or bite to something to eat. You know, maybe you can call up somebody and ask them, can they bring you something to eat? Don't stress like y'all. I'm really praying to God. God, please hear this prayer. I'm really praying to God that people really don't stress over the holidays because we really have been through enough, y'all. And I know what it feels to be depressed on the holidays. And I can honestly say that I'm so grateful that I'm in my right mind and I'm feeling fabulous. Do you hear me? I'm feeling fabulous within, within inside, you know. And I just thank God for that. So, that's all I want to come on here and tell y'all. Y'all just be grateful and be thankful for life. Um, be grateful. And I actually have this on the board in my dining room. I wrote, um, what what are you thankful for? And it made me think about, um, dang, what's her name? What is her name? Oh, it's, oh I can't think of her name, y'all. It's a YouTuber. She has the pink hair. Um, she know who she is. I probably screenshot and put her, um, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna screenshot and put her YouTube channel up here. Shout out to her because she's been doing what are you thankful for? And it really, you know, I always, you know, be grateful for the things that I have. But I also, when I seen that video, you know, I went to my children. I wrote on like one of our boards in the kitchen and I put up what are you thankful for? And my daughter, my son haven't noticed it because he already started playing, um, sports and he been having scrimmage they haven't had their first game yet but he haven't seen it on the board but my daughter have and she wrote up their life she is thankful for life a lot of us be worrying about the wrong things y'all we got to be grateful for breathing air and waking up for the next day so i will see you guys in the next video you guys be blessed Remember what I said and go check out that YouTuber who I just showed y'all, Miss Pam. Go check her out. She is a wonderful lady. She's very, very positive. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.